It's the highest rated show in all of cable television. This is Monday Night Raw. This arena is so loud I can barely hear myself think. That's good. Maybe we won't have to listen to you speak. Michael Cole. The match we have next is going to be awesome. Stay where you are. Taking on some tough competition. You don't want to miss it. And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Inside the ring. Six. Near a count out here, Corey. We know who that is. These two absolutely detest each other. Here is Dolph Ziggler in position now. Dolph Ziggler's going. Ziggler just changed the momentum of this. The shoulders are down. Plenty of fight left. The Maharaja refusing to stay down. What a stomp. Good grief. He's starting to stumble here. He's going to have to cut off his opponent's offense quickly. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Cole. This is just a little bump in the rope. The shoulders on the mat. Referee barely had time to begin a count there. We're going to take more than that. Seth Rollins with a quick kick out. Wow. Oh, nasty impact. <laughs> and there's his speed paying off. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. That's going to hurt. Tear your hamstring. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Guys, the modern day Maharaja has become almost unbeatable since his 2016 return. What strategy do you employ to defeat Jinder Mahal? Quite frankly, I think a lot of people make the mistake of underestimating the modern day Maharaja. I don't think Randy Orton expected much of a challenge at Backlash in 2017, but Mahal brought unexpected fury and left with the WWE Championship. Never take Mahal lightly. Going back to Jinder Mahal being underestimated, I think many veterans enter confrontations judging the modern-day Maharaja by his underperforming initial run in WWE. There's another layer where people expect Mahal to falter when the pressure is on. Shinsuke Nakamura underestimated Mahal at SummerSlam and lost. And at WrestleMania, Randy Orton, Bobby Roode, and Rusev didn't consider Mahal a factor, and they all paid the price. What you call a bad landing? Five. Six. After Triple H, I never thought we'd see somebody use the pedigree in such a dominating fashion. Seven. The finishing move is just one of the things Seth Rollins acquired during his time as a member of the Authority. Somebody wound him up, and he's off and running. 
Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh no, we've got a problem here, guys. No kidding. Who knows what will happen next? I gotta tell you, these guys are in the best shape I've ever seen them in. Cross the shoulders, up and up, Buster. This could be it. Oh no, Seth Rollins needs to worry now. Yeah, the clock's ticking on the King Slam. The cover. Oh, kick out. Not yet. Here it comes, he's got him. Mahal is looking to end this. He might just win this. Here's a cover. And he breaks the cover. He just powered out there, Cole. For years, Monday night has been the most exciting night in sports entertainment, and the action we're seeing here is a lot of the reason why. Monty dodges out of the way. For a schoolboy. Uh -oh. oh, what a super kick from the architect. It, is that it? Is it over? Can he do it here? One, two, three. There's the pinfall and the victory. These superstars put on quite a show. Here's another look. Man, oh man, look at that. Man, this was great. Here is your winner, Seth Rollins. Kicking off the night with an impressive victory. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at somebody who will someday, very soon, be competing in the main event. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks. The belief is strong. One of the most popular superstars in the WWE, no question. this is about. Man, it's on now. Let's listen and see.
clearly a fan favorite. Just a bully. Check that or you go at the door. right there could be dangerous. Bad blood is a boiling. Get that. Check your pulse, everybody. That thing may have killed you with boredom. We all know the WWE Universe has been known to go for blood from time to time, and tonight, just one of those nights. I can't wait to see how the rest of the card shakes out here. Singles action. Don't change that channel. We have singles action coming up next. Let's do it. Definitely an electric feeling to this venue tonight. Oh, oh man! Look at the leg. Oh. Oh, that'll break you in half. What a stomp! Good grief! Oh, oh man! Oh. To the arm, hyperextend your elbow. This might be it. Oh my! What a stop! Good grief! Nailed it! to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Look out, look out. This could be it. She better do something fast. Ah, oh, 
she gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. Oh, my God. Oh! Crushing the knee here. Boom, what impact. Natu she goes for the cover. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. She's still in this one. Alexa Bliss looking stymied. Though we've seen her come back from worse in the past. Pump the brakes a bit, Cole. I know exactly what you're thinking, and I can tell you with all certainty, she still has plenty of gas left in the tank. It's been quite the back and forth battle for these women, guys, and I'm willing to bet that's the way it's going to be the rest of the way. What? On the shoulders here, and it could be a long way down from there. She's playing with fire here. Yeah, she's got to hurry up and get back in there. Uh-oh, no, don't do this. I got right to the gut. Yeah, she's getting after it, showing great energy. What's he doing? This is not how you want to see a matchup like this end. Now let's take another look at these wonderful women in action. Here is your winner, Alexa Bliss. The rep had no choice here but to end this one via count. Man, I'll tell you, going out like that is a tough pill to swallow. And that'll do it here for this one-on-one -on -one match. I hope you enjoyed it as much as this live crowd appears to have enjoyed it. We have a great matchup coming up next. We have one of our breakout talents taking on some tough competition. Each of these competitors looks to gain momentum with a win tonight. Whoever gets the early advantage could take this thing to a win. Man, this card is just packed with so many great matches. And this one is definitely among the most anticipated, I'd say. And the tie-up, make no mistake about it. This is all about skill, determination, and power. Harsh impact. Beautiful technique. What a stop. Good grief. Right between the shoulder blades into the pump handle. Bam, what a slam. Flawlessly executed. What a stomp. Good grief. Good golly, what a knee. Over the years, Rey Mysterio has certainly developed a global following. And guys, it's amazing to see how far he's come since his early days being trained by his uncle in Mexico. Oh, man. He wants no part of the outside. Three. Stationary position, turns around. Oh, 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 man, what a splash. Speaking again of Mysterio's training in Mexico, it's there that Mysterio really got in touch with his Lucha Libre roots and where he developed his undeniable style that wows audiences worldwide today. That's great, but let's be honest. Mysterio was just another luchador before he came over to the ECW, WCW, and eventually WWE. He goes for the cover. 
It's going to take more than that to count. Uh-uh. Ooh, what impact. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. He got body on body there, but that's about it. Nice kick out. He's making a statement here with this attack. You gotta believe this one's over. Harsh impact. Incredible. The night could be over for Rey Mysterio. On the mark. He's going for the pin. Early kick out. Referee right on top of the action. Nah, not yet. Too early. Just a step quicker, it looks like. When this guy's on, look out. All oh, right, turns it around. Ray Mysterio looking for Spoolboy impact. He's in control now. He's stumbling some now. You have to wonder if he could recover from this, guys. He's taken on some damage, but so is his opponent. This match can go either way at this point. He's going for it all. Look at this. Quick thinking to avoid that one. Technique. He's looking a little off balance. I'd say he's starting to feel the pressure a bit. This match is trending in a bad direction for him right now, guys. He's going to want to make some changes. If Ooh, what impact? I'm not sure how much it... This could be it. Cover! Two, three. The pinball and the victory. These guys feel no love for each other. Here's another look. He really put on a great show. Here is your winner, Keith Lee. There's plenty of reason for celebration tonight. That was simply a case of one guy determined to prove his dominance over another. What a match that was, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us. We have a triple threat matchup coming up next. In a triple threat match, you cannot afford to wait. There should be plenty of action early. superstars tear each other apart. Let's see if we get any of that here tonight. Ziggler is here to Man. show the world just how he's got him covered. And he doesn't stay down for long. Yeah, this early, no chance. What a stomp. Good grief. Here's Dolph 
Ziggler in position now. In February of 2017, SmackDown Live was lit thanks to an epic triple threat match for the WWE Championship. Champion Bray Wyatt defended the title against former champions John Cena and AJ Styles. This battle overflowed with mayhem before the match even got underway thanks to Luke Harper attacking his former leader, Bray Wyatt. It's not often that the WWE Championship is incapacitated before a title defense. John Cena and AJ Styles rekindled the rivalry with renewed enthusiasm for destroying one another. Bray Wyatt ended the match and made up for lost time as the Eater of Worlds used his body as a weapon. It was pure chaos as AJ Styles followed suit with an unbelievable array of aerial attacks on both superstars. And John Cena continued to fight back in hopes of winning a record-breaking 17th World Championship. All three superstars pulverized each other with every move in their respective arsenals. When it looked like another air assault was coming from AJ Styles, John Cena thwarted the attempt and then walked right into Sister Abigail from Bray Wyatt to end the conflict. In that victory, the WWE went further into the darkness that was the era of war. Have you ever seen a human being tossed like that? Bobby Lashley into the cover! He's always up for a challenge, and tonight is no different. In a back-and-forth match like this, he has to do everything in his power not to let his opponent gain too much momentum here. Byron, before you mention the strategy some superstars have implemented for competing in the triple threat match, and that includes having a finishing maneuver to put someone away for the one, two, three, and a submission to make them tap out. There are many superstars in... Oh, oh, oh. we know what's coming next. Oh, boy, do we ever. Now he's got to capitalize. Hey, what goes up must come down. Ziggler with the famous serve. Can he finish the jump? And a kick out. How in the world? Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. Looking at it here. He's back in control. There's a pin now. No, kicks out in time. Dolph can absorb a lot more punishment than that. a tough target. You gotta believe this one's over. Now that got those shoulders on the mat. And there's the kick out by Randy Orton. Randy is everything a superstar should be. That's proof right there. What a stop. Good grief. He might have This match might be over, guys. Randy Orton's in a world of hurt! And the Viper needs to rally quick. The triple threat match is definitely getting to test his metal. Going for the big one. Oh, close line! He's got the shoulders down. What is keeping this competitor going? Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. Sweet champ music! Here's his moment, Michael. His shoulders are down. And the count's 
broken, keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar world assault ever does. Success breeds success, and he's definitely having some right now. Uh-oh, Cole, I think we know what the Viper's doing. Yeah, Randy Orton was in position. Good night. That should do it. Just as ruthless as the first time we saw it. And Ziggler gets out of the way quickly. Lightning speed from Dolph. Going for the cover. This is clearly not the same competitor who started this match in such cool. <laughs> but can he follow up here? He can end it here. Two. And he manages to get the shoulder up. Can you believe what he's withstood here today? Hot backdrop suplex. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Two. Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? Wow. I am impressed. He's calling for it. place for him to be right now. Unceremoniously deposited down. The Viper strikes again. I love it. He's got the shoulders down. One, two. I don't know too many other guys that would have been able to kick out of that. You better change direction. That's not going to keep a finely tuned machine like Dolph Ziggler down. Not now. Ziggler with the famous sir. Ziggler has this match in hand, guys. Shoulders down. Two. Oh, somehow. Just barely, but it counts. Right to the back of the net. He's left wide open here. I don't think he even realizes it. He looks dazed. This is about to get bad. Nice. Will it be? Two. And he got a near fall out of it. Not yet. Shoot me. Hoping to end it here. Two. And he got a near fall out of it. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Predator stays in the hunt with that kick out. And here, this could be it. Is he done? And he fights his way free. He's got to be working on instinct right now. The Viper getting absolutely pounded right now. Just barely got out of the way. Belly to belly. Vicious. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Here we go for the win. Two. Three. And that's the match. These guys gave everyone their money's worth. Here's another look. He ain't playing here. Here is your winner, Bobby Lashley. Nice job turning back both competitors here tonight. The Apex Predator fell prey to a better opponent tonight. I can't believe it happened.
What a great match we just saw here on Raw. Thank you to everybody at home for choosing to spend part of your Monday night with us. We have a great matchup coming up next. It'll be Asuka. This matchup has the potential to be special. We could be moments away from an instant classic. I don't know who's looking more forward to this, the women in the ring or me. You know what I like about her? She's approaching this match the same as she would if the title was on the line. Taking out the arm, great strategy. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Career. What does your opponent have to do care of in this match tonight? Oh, it sounds almost impossible, but you can't be intimidated by Asuka. She can be absolutely mesmerizing in the ring. You can ask any woman on the roster. I mean, Asuka carries this aura of invincibility. It's a mind game as much as it is physical. You're like a poet, Corey. Ooh, that kick could be a game changer. Becky Lynch going for it. Talking about Asuka's intimidating aura, Corey. Her reputation for... No, she escapes it. Yeah, I don't know if she had it locked in fully, Michael. Uh-oh. Asuka looks stunned by that. But I'd be surprised if she doesn't find a way back in control of this thing. You know, she's the kind of competitor that actually Ouch. likes getting hit. It motivates her. And this might just be what she needs to put her over the top, believe it or not. Thinking about Asuka, I can rattle off a list of numbers associated with her accomplishments, but I was personally there when her 523-day reign as NXT Women's Champion began. And in my book, that's right up there with Joe DiMaggio's 56-game hit streak. Becky Lynch just too fast for her. I want to mention some of the numbers associated with Asuka, but let me just state a couple pertinent ones. That 523 days is the longest championship reign of the modern era, and seventh longest. Oh, Michael, had Asuka not voluntarily relinquished the NXT Women's Championship when she joined the WWE roster. Boom! Boom. Nice! <laughs> oh, man! Definitely not where you want to be right now. Gotta find a way to get out of this, Michael. Now back to the ring. Dangerously close to getting counted out. Definitely cutting it close, Michael. What does Becky Lynch have to do at this point to stay in the match? She definitely doesn't want to absorb much more punishment if she wants to be successful here tonight. It looks to me, guys, like she may have underestimated her opponent here tonight, and now she's paying for it. Nobody wants to face Asuka when she's rolling. Asuka with a kick downstairs. Not with a body oh. hip attack. She certainly looked at a quick pin attempt by Asuka. She's still in it. She's still in this one. Yeah, I love the... And it's Asuka making the move. She's starting to fight out, guys. She fights out. But that doesn't mean the damage wasn't already done, Michael. The Oscar lock. Uh-oh. Man, she knows how to make a comeback. Oscar did it. What a huge win. Now let's take a look back at these ladies in action. She left it all in the ring, and I expected nothing Here less. Here is your winner, Asuka! I can't imagine the pain that must have been inflicted by that move. That's the kind of win that makes you feel good about yourself.
Yeah, you can bet they're going to be talking about this match for quite some time. We have a great match coming up next. Gonna settle the score. there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Look at the presumptuous attitude of Kevin Owens. It's called confidence, Saxton, and all the elite superstars have it. You have to walk in believing you're going to beat up your opponent. on some offense here, but that's oh. to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring with. You see more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in it. I say Drew McIntyre's career is a story of two completely different chapters. Setting up for a look harsh impact. Nice. Shut it down. The night could be over for Kevin Owens. of McIntyre's career as two different chapters. And while chapter one didn't necessarily blow anybody away, they're... look at this. And Kevin Owens quickly kicks out. Too early in the match to end it. superstar more driven to succeed than Drew McIntyre. When he was released in 2014, McIntyre said he'd be back, and that's exactly what happened. Well, McIntyre really took a negative and turned it into a positive. Instead of feeling sorry for himself and blaming everybody else, he traveled the globe and made himself an even bigger star. And into a quick cover as Kevin Owens. And an early kick out in this unusual matchup. Too soon. Following up on what you two were saying about McIntyre's initial release, not only did he return with more fire and fans, he also came back in even better shape than before. And yeah, McIntyre's always had a height advantage, but in his time away, he worked on his strength, conditioning, and added considerable power to his Claymore kick and aftershock DDT. Back in from the floor. Wait a minute. in one of the best in the business. Kick to the... Fireman's carry. This doesn't look good, Corey. Couldn't agree more, Cole. This has got trouble written all over it. it back into the ring. Oh, big boot. That is a game 
changer. He's making a statement here with this attack. If you recall, guys, when Drew McIntyre first showed up here in 2019, the chosen one. And while it may have been premature, it might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. It goes down hard. initial run in WWE had ups and downs, but ever since his return in 2017, I'd say McIntyre's among the most dominant superstars on the roster. As would the people. Shoulders down, this could be it. It's going to take more than that to keep his shoulders down. He's still in this. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Kevin Owens. Pump handle applied. That might just be the final nail in the coffin. Drew McIntyre really needs to dig down deep and fast. He's in trouble. Kevin Owens setting it up. And here's a cover. Two. I wouldn't have been surprised if that was it. Wow. Drew McIntyre has chosen to kick out here. See what I did? At some point, the referee may want to think about stopping this one before somebody gets seriously injured. He's a guy that can turn it on whenever he wants. Kevin Owens just too fast for him. Surprisingly quick. Here he goes. Cannonball by Kevin This one is over. Drew McIntyre really needs to dig down deep and fast. Two. You can't teach the type of tenacity we're witnessing here. Unreal. McIntyre still in this. Here we go. Kevin Owens is setting it up. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing left. He's calling for it. One, two, three! And you can put this singles match in the books. We got our money's worth for that one. Take a look. He's getting after it here. Still can't believe I get paid to... So over and McIntyre stands victorious. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your... Hope you enjoyed that great match.